Hi, welcome to the studio. It's me and Finn. We're doing a nature collage today. Um, so we need some things from nature. Can you show them what we found? We went out the yard and found some things. You want to hold up what some of those are? Some of those pieces? Look one. Yep, we found it's Creeping Jenny is what it's called in Alaska. And got this fun leaf. And what's that? Is that a flower? Okay. Our flower, we've got a fern. And what about this one? You want to and this one? cute. And that piece, yep. So we found lots of leaves. So for this project, you're going to want to um, find lots of flat um, natural objects. Leaves are great, flowers are great. And then you're going to need a canvas board, which is one of these. The canvas board is really hard on, one so um, on both sides, covered with canvas, um, but not flexible. You don't want something really hard for this. You could also use cardboard if you don't have a canvas board. And you're gonna want some kind of glue. You can use a spray glue, or we're gonna be using Mod Podge. Um, tacky glue will work too, that's okay. And um, a paintbrush, a paper towel, and some black paint, and some tin foil, just regular tin aluminum foil. And then if you want to do the extra step that I'll show you today, we're also using steel wool. So you want something um, kind of like those SOS pads, only without the cleaning stuff on them, just regular steel wool. Fine would be best. Okay, you ready to start? This is what our project will look like. I'll show you here. So you can see we're going to take a bunch of nature products and put them on um, some canvas board and then cover them with foil, paint them, and then r and rub the paint off when it's dry. All right, you ready? Okay, so what we're going to do is um, put some glue on here. Would you like to use a paintbrush to paint this with some glue? Okay, or you can use this paintbrush if you want. Is it okay if you got it on the paper? Yep. Is it okay if you got it on the paper? Yep. Oh, I guess. How about over here? You can smoke there too. Okay, we've got lots of glue. Good. That was easy, wasn't it? Well, that was Let's fast. Put the paintbrush in the water. Okay, now get your, your leaf that you just picked and set it down on top of the wet glue. Okay. So we're going to press that down really hard as much as we can. And then get another leaf that you want, Finn. What would you like the next one to be? Good. Press it down the best that we can. Here's the glue. Oh, that's a good one. Put that over there. Okay. Set that there. You want to press it down. Get really Ooh. steep. Put, pat it down with your hands. It's okay if you get glue on your fingers. Oh, there we go. So I think we have room for maybe a couple more. What little things do we have? Something like this, a fern, or one of those, or a flower petal. Okay, is it done? Yes. Okay, let's so start. let's hold it up, and then we'll cover it with some foil. Wow, it's so, it's so finished up. <laughs> so finished up? And now it's stuck. Yeah, so you could leave it like this if you wanted to, if you wanted to leave all the greenery, but we're going to do a, um, a textural collage, so we're going to cover it with some foil next. So then the next thing we need to do is take this big piece of foil, okay? You just want to cut it um, maybe two inches wider and longer than your um, canvas board is, so you can wrap it around the back. So Finn, here you go. You want to help me with this part? Set it upside down on the foil. So turn this up, you don't want to touch it? All right, you can help me with this part then. So we flip it upside down. Is there no glue on this side? Uh-uh. See, this is not, there's no glue here. Okay, so now we're going to take these and wrap them around. Can you take this so it wraps all the way to the back? And then we press it. Okay, good. And let's turn it over so we can do the other side. Okay, do the same thing on this side. Can you lift this part up and wrap it? Press it really good. Okay, and then the same thing with the edges. Let's put those on too. Let's put those on the back. Can you wrap that part? There you go. And then you'll tape this part here. Tape it down so it doesn't come undone. And then, now Finn, here's the fun part. You ready? We're gonna take our fingers and press like this in a circle all over so we can see the plants. See how we can see the edge of the leaf showing up? Okay, so come up here so you can take your fingers. Take two fingers like this. Take two fingers, yeah, and just go in a circle, pressing really good till we can see. Look at it. Can you see some leaves showing up? It's hard to push. Yeah, push kind of hard. Yep, like this. Go in a circle. Do you see the leaves? Okay, so there's our silver covered piece. 
So now we're gonna take some black paint. I'm just using regular um, craft paint, just standard stuff you buy in any craft store. We put it in a bowl, yep, like Ben's showing you. And now we're just gonna paint over the whole thing. So you ready? This part's kind of fun. You need your paintbrush again. So we have a little bit on our, on our brush and we're just gonna brush right over the top of the foil. Just paint the whole thing black. Do we miss any spots or does it look good? Okay, go ahead. You can go over that if you need to. Okay, and then put your paintbrush in the water. That's oil and paint on there. That's okay. Once it's dry, we'll swap these out. This one is already dry. Yep, so I'm going to show them how we scrape off some of the black. So we'll let that one dry for a little bit and come back to it. So once it's dry and it's covered in black, imagine that this one still has a lot of black. You take some steel wool like this water it up and just really gently go in a circular motion to scrape off some of the black. You don't want to go too hard or what would happen do you think if I rub really hard? Do you have any no. idea? You don't know? It would rip this. It would rip the foil off and then you would see your canvas underneath and that would, that would mess up the picture. So we just go really gently in a circle. This is all optional. So you could, like I said, leave it without the um, foil. I'm sorry, without the foil on it, just to be all natural. We'll cover it with foil and leave it like that. Or you can cover it with black paint and then rub it off. And then you would get this when it's all done. And Easy. Give, it, give it to somebody. Yeah, they'd make a nice gift, wouldn't it? You're yeah. really pretty to get somebody. And put it in your mail and put it your mail in and they'll come outside and take a mail hole and they'll just grab it out and see what it is. Yeah. You think yeah. they would like it? Yeah. Who should we give this to? Or give one to? Got an idea? Don't know. Don't know? What do you think about it? Yeah. Well, should we say bye for now? Wanna say bye? Say see you oh, next time. I, I forgot something. What? What does that mean? Four. Four. Pins four. Say see you next I'm time. Still. Still four. See I'm, you next time. It takes a long time trying to be fine. <laughs> yeah, it takes a long time. Yep. Five is this. Yes. This, this number is five. Yes. You know your numbers really well, don't you? Yeah, it goes to one, two, three, four, five, eight. Yep. All right, let's say bye. I'm not saying yet. <laughs> no, not yet. See you later.